of that story about the powerboat rider who quite literally cheated death. Steve Fitzsimmons from Merseyside has been telling of his remarkable escape after crashing at more than 100 miles per hour. Yeah, it all happened when Steve was taking part in this weekend's Barrow Grand Prix. The crash was all caught on film, and just looking at the pictures, well, you would never have thought that anyone could have survived. But we're pleased to report that he did, and he's been talking to Caroline Wareham. Steve Fitzsimmons was on the fastest part of the race when he lost control. He hit the water at an incredible 110 miles an hour. I remember hitting the water, yeah. Um, the canopy went, the visor on my helmet went. Um, I forgot to take the steering wheel off, but I realise now why, because it's spent. Um, and then I just fold it out, see both off and go down. Back at base in St Helens, Steve assesses the damage. Luckily, only to the boat, as incredibly, he walked away uninjured. Billy Owens was in the boat behind. The frightening thing is, you're strapped into the cockpit, so when you're upside down in the water and when you're going past, you're praying for somebody to come up, and uh, eventually Steve did pop up and he had all his fingers and all his toes, so uh, that is the biggest release. The race doesn't count for anything at that point. But Steve hasn't been put off. In fact, after borrowing a friend's boat, he came third in his next heat the very next day. Caroline Wareham, Granada reports, St. Helens. Lucky man. Very lucky. Yeah, yeah well done to Steve.